In this video, we will examine what Camus means by absurd freedom. We can negate everything except the desire for unity, the longing to solve, and the need for clarity and cohesion. The problem is that we cannot know whether this world has a meaning that transcends it or not. But what we do know is that we do not know that meaning and it is impossible for us to know it. What you must remember is that the absurd returns to a man's life and finds its home there. When this happens and the absurd tempts you, you must insist on one method, to persist. Are we to commit suicide? It was previously a question of finding out whether or not life had to have a meaning to be lived. It now becomes clear, on the contrary, that it will be lived all the better if it has no meaning. But no one will live this fate knowing it to be absurd, unless he does everything to keep before him that absurd brought to light by consciousness. Negating one of the terms of the opposition on which he lives amounts to escaping it. And we've previously established that we must not resort to escapism. Suicide settles the absurd. It engulfs the absurd in the same death, but in order to keep alive the absurd cannot be settled. So what remains as an option if not suicide? Metaphysical revolt. Keep in mind, revolt is not aspiration, for it is devoid of hope. Revolt is the certainty of a crushing fate without the resignation that ought to accompany it. Consciousness and revolt. These rejections are the contrary of renunciation. So what does life mean in an absurd universe? Nothing else but indifference to the future and a desire to use up everything that is given. Now if the absurd cancels all my chances of eternal freedom, it restores and magnifies on the other hand my freedom of action. And when I say freedom, I do not mean freedom in the outside world. I mean inner freedom. The absurd enlightens me on this point. There is no future. Henceforth, this is the reason for my inner freedom. At the end, Camus draws three consequences from the absurd. Revolt, freedom, and passion. Thank you.